Slipknot members Clown, V-Man, and The New Guy, also affectionately known by fans as Tortilla Man, participated in a Q&A today to promote Slipknot whiskey. They were also signing bottles. Of course, I tried to order one and I couldn't get one because they don't ship to my way. So I'm furious about that. But uh, the interview was actually very, very cool and very fun. And there were a few interesting revelations from this interview I want to tell you guys about. First, Clown revealed that V-Man, um, the new guy, and uh, himself had been working on writing new Slipknot material. It's unclear if other members of Slipknot are involved. He didn't specifically reference if they were or not. I would imagine they were. But he says that they've been spending the last couple of weeks writing new material for the Slipknot record. Here is a little bit of that. Been doing good. good. Right now is kind of an interesting time. We're, uh, we're uh, taking this time to write some new music. So for the last week, we've been just... Uh, having a good time, eating a lot of food, and writing God music. So we're, uh, we're having a good time. So I, I've come from uh, the UK, so we're in a bit of a lockdown as well at the moment. So we flew over a couple of weeks ago. We're lucky to have been able to get in, to be able to come over the pond and uh, do what we do. And since everybody's taking a lot of time off, we thought we'd utilize it by getting together and do what we probably do best, which is write music. Awesome. So it's, it's been good because there's no pressure. It's not like we have to. Um, we're doing it because we want to. And um, it's just been a blessing because, you know, boredom can set in and I know all of us in the world are going crazy. So we're really lucky to be able to be together and do what we love most. Absolutely. Now I've linked to Slipknot Whiskey in the comment now, I've linked to Slipknot Whiskey in the description of this video. I have had the chance to taste it, uh, but I've run out and I can't get it delivered. I will say this. I will say this. Not quite White Claw, but it's really, really close. I accept your apology. It's really close. <laughs> this is very good. Really, really good stuff. All right, Clown was also asked about what he thinks the lyrical themes on this next Slipknot album will entail and whether or not the sort of current state of the world will make its way into Slipknot music. You know, we don't usually speak for Corey or whatever, but um, I can imagine that anything that affects him uh, and affects us and affects you it, it will be included. To, to the extent, I don't know how blatant it will be, I don't know, but uh, we are all living this and everybody is involved. So wouldn't really know what Corey, w what road he's going to be going down or, or information that he wants to spread, you know, not sure. We're not quite there yet. So that's very exciting. And again, you can pick up Slipknot Whiskey in the link in the comments. Hopefully you'll have more luck than I will getting some shipped out to you. All right, folks, that is all for now. Thanks so much for joining me today at Rockfeed. If you're new here, please consider subscribing with notifications on so you don't miss out on breaking news and updates. Thanks again for joining me and I'll see you all very soon.